just yesterday, Okowa came out to say that Peter Obi do not have the capacity to rule Nigeria and they also do not have the mental, you know, know-how, should I put it that way, the mental know-how to lead a country like Nigeria with all the challenges that the country is facing at the moment. So right now, Deti Ahmed, the vice presidential candidate for the Labour Party alongside Peter Obi, has come out to respond to that comment that um, Okowa made. Before we go into the details of today's news, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do well to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. Most importantly, click on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we post a new video. Without further ado, let's dive straight into the details of today's news. Governor Ifai Okowa of Delta State and the vice presidential candidate of Labour Party, Deti Ahmed, were at each other's throat yesterday over the purported capacity of the presidential candidate of a party, Peter Obi, to lead the country. Okowa, who is the vice presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, spoke in an interview with BBC Pigeon. But in a swift reaction, Deity Ahmed said, Okowa had no idea what capacity is, adding that Obi remains the most qualified for the presidency. Admitting that Obi had as experience from being a former governor, he however added that it was not deep enough to lead Nigeria. He said, I did not say you won't have any votes, you will have, but what I'm saying is that he's not a new candidate, it has not been long since he left PDP. You know he was in Abga before, from Abga he came to PDP. It hasn't been long since he left PDP, so he cannot say anything about PDP because that's where he was before. Some of us are still here. At every party, there are good people and bad people. But today's Nigeria is very troubled and we need the right person. That is why I am appealing to our youth to be wise and vote well. They should not be blinded by the concept of a false change because that is how they raved on Jonathan in 2015, Peter Obi's previous experience is not enough for this one presidency. It will be had. Even as a current governor ruling in a time of crisis, I know how hard it is. I even want to learn under Atiku because he has experience with the federal government. The thing is not easy for them to have undo the economy at that time and made it something better offering hope creating jobs and filtering the society was not easy because it is a bigger thing so someone is supposed to learn through that if you look at obi's experience you will know it's small on the crisis in the pdp okowa said governor nelson wiki of river state is his friend and that he was making an effort to reach out to him. He said, and I quote, We've been talking internally. Everything is being settled. You know that when something happens and everybody can't agree, it's settled bit by bit. That is what we are still working on from inside. We are finding ways to talk. I would say, he is my friend. I am his friend and we will find a way to talk. Hateku has said his vision of what happened and I am sure that, vash, pardon me, Hateku has said his version of what happened and I am sure that version he said is the true position. I am also not saying that Wiki is lying, but if someone carries the anger, it is important to air your views. For us in the party, it's about how to bring everybody together, how all of us can work together. 
Wiki is still a very important member of the party. He has worked so hard for the party, as many of us have worked hard too. So we pray that everything come together and we talk. I'm sure very soon we'll be sitting down. The decision of Atiku Abubaka, presidential candidate of the PDP, to name Okowa as his running mate for the 2023 presidential election caused division in the party. Some stake, party stakeholders, including Governor Samuel Otom of Benue State, has expressed concern over Atiku's decision to ignore Wiki who was recommended for the position by the party's National Working Committee, NWC. Wiki placed second in the party's presidential primary election, which took place in May. Okowa has no idea of what capacity is or be most qualified, is most qualified for presidency, Deity Ahmed response to what um, Okowa said earlier. But reacting to Okowa's statement yesterday, Deity Baba Ahmed, vice presidential candidate of the Labour Party, asked Okowa to retract it. Baba Ahmed, who spoke in an interview with Channel's Television, said Obi remained the most qualified among the candidates of the four leading candidates vying for the presidency. He said, that is absolutely untrue. In fact, I beg you to show me anyone who has had more leadership experience in the 2023 contest. By that contest, I mean the candidates that we have, the four leading candidates. I fail to see anyone who even comes close to His Excellency Peter Obi. The world is now at the stage where we need private sector experience and among all of them, no one has much private sector business sense, prudence, frugality, ability to manage persons, communities, interest groups. None of the other three has as much. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a thumbs up. I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.